Hey, what's up everyone? This is Alan, your Las Vegas and Henderson Realtor of Simply Vegas. Today I'll be showing you drone footage of Kesho Village and Kesho Commons in Summerlin West of Las Vegas, Nevada. Before we get started, please consider taking a moment to hit that like button, subscribe button, and notification button. Thank you so much. Kesho Village is located at the northernmost edge of Summerlin West. It overlooks the Las Vegas Valley from an elevation above 3,000 feet. Located west of the 215 and south of Lake Mead Boulevard, Kesho Village sits at the skirts of these beautiful mountains. I have many clients that have purchased in the many different communities in Kesho Village, and this community continues to grow. Over the Tower Mountains is a community of reverence by Palti Homes. This community is part of Summerlin but not located in Kesho Village. Reverence is also fully built out and there are no new homes for sale in this community. Here's a drone shot facing west, starting with the Guardgate community of Reverence. And as we head south, there is Monument by Pulte Homes, which is a new upcoming community. Monument is a collection of two-story townhomes with four different floor plans. Next, we have Crescent Canyon by Taylor Morrison. These are two to three-story homes that range between 1,600 to 2,200 square feet. And then there's Falcon Crest by Woodside Homes. These are one-story single-family homes that range between 1,900 to 2,200 square feet. And then there's Osprey Ridge by Richmond American Homes. These are two-story single-family homes that range between 2,300 square feet up to 2,500 square feet. Then there's Blacktail by Palti Homes. They are three-story single-family homes with rooftop decks. These empty lots that you see here are future communities of Taylor Merson, Lennar, and Woodside Homes. And then lastly, we have Vero by Woodside Homes, Nighthawk by KB Home, a future KB Home community, and future Toll Brothers community. As we look further south, between these communities is the future urban core. This is projected to be a smaller version of downtown Summerlin. Next to the urban core is the future Grand Park Village. Further south from here is Red Point Village, Red Point Square, the Paseos, the Vistas, and Stone Bridge. All these communities I've mentioned are located in Summerlin West. Here's a different drone shot facing east. You can see that we're much higher in elevation compared to the rest of the Las Vegas Valley. When driving down toward the 215 Beltway, you have amazing views of the Las Vegas Strip. A great advantage of being in a higher elevation is that you'll get cooler summers. I have heard of temperatures being anywhere between 3 degrees to 10 degrees cooler than the rest of the Las Vegas Valley. The road that we're following here is West Lake Mead Boulevard. This road will extend to the future villages. From a different angle, this is Crested Canyon by Taylor Morrison. Crescent Canyon is becoming close to being sold out. South of Crescent Canyon is Falcon Crest by Woodside Homes, followed by Blacktail by Pulte Homes, and then Vario by Woodside Homes. The line between Kesho Village and the 215 Beltway is currently owned by the Howard Hughes Corporation. I'm not sure what they plan to build there yet, but it might be commercial or light retail units. As we face to the north, to the west of us would be the future villages. As you head further west, the elevation gets higher and higher. I would imagine that many of these future communities will have amazing views. Not just of the mountains, but also the Las Vegas Valley. The rest of this video will be drone footage of Summerlin West, so hang around and enjoy.
This concludes my drone tour of Kishol Village and Summerlin West. If you enjoyed this video and like to see more content like this, please consider subscribing to my channel. If you have any questions or like my real estate assistance when buying or selling home in Las Vegas or Henderson, please give me a call, text, or email. Thank you so much guys for watching to the very end, and I'll see you in the next video.